lots of people here. That's great. Uh, thank you, everyone, for coming. We're scheduled to run from now until approximately 4, 4.30, depending how short or over the panels go. And, uh, and uh, we have, I think we're having some other drinks arriving later on. Uh, but up until now, we've got coffee and tea and bickies and, and whatever else. So today we have uh, three panels. Grant, if you have a crack at not necessarily screen share. Oh, yeah, screen share. Okay. So we have um, three panels to get through, panel discussions. And um, those panels have already pre-recorded, a little bit like colloquium, but we got our we get our ideas from colloquium, I guess, uh, are doing it. We've we pre-recorded interviews with people on the panel, largely so the panel could get to know each other before they become a panel, um, hopefully. So if you would like to revisit the ideas that were talked about, then you put into your Google search um, blended learning online teaching and Wikiversity at the end will target it probably. And then you'll arrive at, at uh, well, this is one of the panel pages, uh, but you'll arrive at the Greg, if you could just show us between the session uh, again, I just want to give a plug for the, uh, the website that we're trying to build to support an ongoing type of practice. Um, a, it's an online community of practice called uh, Teachers of Health Professionals. And we're actively recruiting participation in that forum, not just the Trove people, so we can get a bit of cross semination of not just institutional workers either. At the moment, we've got about um, 60 members. Our target is 200 members from experience. The online community self sustains itself at about 200, at about a 10% rule. 20 people will start contributing. At the moment, it's just me contributing, and uh, you can see that by all the posts. The way the page works is you just scroll down, and there are videos and discussion links and all sorts of stuff, interviews with staff about what they're doing and, and, and things like that. The idea, if at the top, if you join the community and you had a question on anything, you just pop it into the top, and someone in the community, probably me at this stage, will answer the question either in a video demonstration or if it's a simple answer, it's just that. So um, I encourage you to just put in your Google search, Google Plus, Teachers of Health Community, uh, te Teachers of Health Professionals, look at that page, consider joining it, and uh, hopefully it's some assistance to you. You will need a Google account. Yes, you will need a Google account and um, expose yourself to the watchful eyes of our national security agencies if you. Well, if it's good enough, Brian, we'll know. Yes, and uh, unbeknownst to us, uh, that actually, uh, that level of watching is um, much more convenient for national security agencies when you're on the university network. But uh, you might want to look at that if that concerns you at all. Most of the time, so um, the other point is that uh, the event page here, if we could look at that graph, and I think we may have missed it on the tab there, the uh, Wikiversity page. Uh, events. No, no, the Wikiversity page for this event. You type well, in sorry, blended yeah. just there in the address bar. Before you get off the other thing with a Google account and whatnot. Yeah. How do you get on there? Where do you, so you wouldn't get to that without a Google account. No, you get to it. Yes. So you just put in a Google search, yes. Google Plus Teachers yes. of Health Professionals, and the first <coughs> link will get to it, unless you're using Bing or something. But yeah. Uh, unfortunately, it doesn't have a very quick URL. And the intention is that when we get, to, if, it, if it shows signs of growing, I'll set it up so that it automatically links with Facebook and Twitter and and all of that stuff, so we're not not limiting ourselves to that. Channel. I just sort of made a choice that those of us who do use Facebook probably like to keep a clear distinction between what I do with my family and everyday life and what I do with work, and I assume that we don't use Google that much for this, so it might be a, a convenient way to keep that demarcation. Um, yeah, in that in that browser tab. There,